Greece hasn't been far from the German Chancellor's thoughts since the Eurozone crisis erupted, but Angela Merkel hasn't visited for five years. She travelled to Athens to show her support for the government's tough austerity measures as it battles to get its finances under control. But she didn't bring her Greek counterpart Antony Samaras the promise of new money. I came here with the firm knowledge and awareness that the period Greece is currently experiencing is a very difficult one, especially for the people in Greece, that many people are suffering, that a lot is being demanded of them, and that's why I also like to say that a large part of the distance has already been covered. Her speech didn't go down well with Greeks. After five years of recession, many blame her and Germany for painful austerity measures, conditions of two bailout packages. Thousands ignored restrictions on public gatherings, giving 6,000 police officers a difficult job. As well as scuffles in front of the Greek parliament, some protesters burnt Nazi flags. Merkel certainly changed her tune about Greece in recent months. She now wants to keep them in the Eurozone. And, says Christian Schulz from Bernberg Bank, she's trying to deflect criticism that she's demanded cuts without offering sympathy. Germany does not want to put up any new money ahead of next year's elections. The IMF wants to know now what will happen over the next few years to Greek funding. Um, a compromise will be forged and the Europeans have one big ally on the other side of the Atlantic. The American government also does not want the Greek uh, situation to spiral out of control again. <laughs> The Troika of international lenders will report on Athens' progress in early November, weeks before Greece runs out of money. Without their vote of confidence, the next 31 billion euro instalment of aid won't be handed over. Merkel's show of support may be intended to bolster the government, but what Greece really needs is cash and a way out of the crisis. Joanna Partridge, Reuters.